Do you ever get in a vegetable rut and you think, what am I going to cook? And it's the same vegetables over and over. Well, I have a good idea for you. This is the broccoli and pecans with creamy harsh radish sauce. And I turn to my Gulf Coast favorites for this recipe. It is one that I turn to when I want it just to jazz up my vegetables. So all we've done here is I have cooked broccoli. Now, I prefer to roast the broccoli because it sort of gives it that uh, intensifies the flavor and makes it really good. Right, and broccoli is a great vegetable because it has lots of fiber in it and by roasting it you keep all the nutrients intact. Yeah, and my secret is I always put it on a foil lined pan so there's no cleanup. So roast it about 20, 25 minutes just till you start it gets brown around the edges uh, at about 400 degrees. Now, you could cook it in the microwave or you could even use frozen broccoli and cook it, whatever works best for you. So we have our broccoli and now the secret part of it or the magic mm -hmm. ingredient is our sauce. So we've started with some light mayo and then I'm using skim milk. And these are great low-fat ingredients. Yeah they are and that's how I'm trying to keep the sauce not so good. It's good for you and it tastes right. good. Okay and our horseradish. Horseradish actually aids in digestion so it's a great combination with the high fiber broccoli. Yeah and this just gives it a great flavor. Um, you know it sort of gives it a little spunks up the recipe and then we're just going to put our pecans. Pecans are a great source of omega fatty acids and they're lean, good for your heart. And I have to have pecans on everything anyway, so that's a good thing. All right, and here's our sauce. And then we're just going to finish it off with little breadcrumbs and just a tad bit of grated Parmesan cheese, just so when it gets in the oven it gets that good toasty look. Now, we are done. You just bake it at 350 for about 20 to 25 minutes. So I'm going to go pop it in the oven. And look what I just got out. Yum. Looks delicious. Easy to make. Just a few ingredients from my Gulf Coast Favorites books. And all my recipes have your nutritional information and your diabetic exchange. Great recipes.